legacy of this place. Okay, she says, but also it's very negative. Where does the internet get this information from if you no longer have the internet? His father and his government. This change in the media and the death of the democratic battle, look at these cartoons. They're vicious, ferocious, but it's all over issue. Um, free trade, this is trade, and it was the Democrats who were supporting free trade because they saw protection as a subsidy for the industrial masses and it passed. based not on a naked quest for power, on real issues. And I don't I don't see that so much anymore. Take take the healthcare debate right now. They're carving up the pie. The public has no lobby. So that's why we have a different Stevens and Senators try to address some of these systemic Yes, sir. Uh, Stevens was playing the old slaves down in Kentucky and the uh, Lincolns, on the other hand, they came north uh, to get away from the Quakers, you know, they wanted to get away from slavery. Uh, didn't your grand, uh, Adlai one have a problem with uh, his support for Douglas in the 1860 and had to kind of smooth that over with the spells and so on? They start. They were Methodists, and then they start going to the Unitarian Church, and it's yeah. kind of ironic. I'm not sure I heard all of the questions. Well, you, you're at least one. Then he support Douglas. Oh yeah, he's a Democrat. Yeah, he's a Democrat. So. Yeah, and if you look at some of these cartoons, he may have been a copperhead. He may have gotten somebody to serve for him in the <laughs> Civil War. Uh, no, it was Jesse Fell on the maternal side of the family, who was the secretary of the Republican Party and uh, a good citizen who supported me. Adlai, uh, uh, in the Black Book, recalls seeing Lincoln listening to his, some of his, uh, and commenting on some of his, uh, very favorably on some of his speeches, but, but he was a Democrat who supported government. I guess my family is on both sides of that election. <laughs> <laughs>